Hi everyone, welcome back to the Navigant Credit Union Broadcast Center. I'm Go Local News Editor Kate Nagel. would like to welcome in singer-songwriter Mary B. Thanks for coming in. I appreciate you taking the time to come downtown because you're getting ready for a big show tomorrow night. Tom Petty tribute at the Columbus Theater. Lots of musicians will be turning out, but you've been a musician of a little notoriety as of late. <laughs> I guess so. <laughs> Talk with us before we go on to Tom Petty about penning your Benny song. That was so funny. Um, so I wrote this song with my mom. We we just we drove by Benny's. We were out Christmas shopping one day, and we we realized we couldn't go to Benny's. And I, I was like, Mom, it's the first Christmas without Benny's. And um, we were just like, that has to be a song. And she she writes poetry, and I'm a songwriter, and we've never written together. But um, but it, you collaborated just, with your mom. Yeah. How long did it take for this to come together? <laughs> couple days you know like we, we wrote our parts separate and then we came together to kind of you know tweak things and um, yeah it was really fun like I know like I want to write with my mom more like she's a really good writer. So. It might be in the family but how did you get your start singing and songwriting? Oh gosh um, since I was a little kid um, in church choir and choir in school and then I you know had a band in high school and um, moved to Los Angeles recently to pursue it a little bit further and just been touring and going all over the place. Just finished a tour in Hawaii a couple months ago and that was really fun and um, yeah, just just haven't stopped. Just haven't stopped. <laughs> we'll, have, we'll put up a link if you're watching this after to the, the Benny song. Were you surprised at the reaction? <laughs> yes. Like I really thought my family was the only kind of weirdos that like loved this store. Like I loved Benny. <laughs> and when I moved to Los Angeles actually, I remember going around and, and trying to find like the Los Angeles equivalent of Benny's. <laughs> and it doesn't exist. Like there's no stores no. like that in no. <laughs> So um, yeah, we, we, you know, we're not the only weirdos apparently and um, I put it up in just like within a couple days I mean between a couple different platforms there's like 15,000 views and like hundreds and hundreds of shares and viral like, viral <laughs> viral <laughs> all about Benny's again as I said wanted to make a little plug for that because it was very popular as of late but speaking of popular and it's always sad when we see musicians pass away and Tom Petty so many musicians are turning out tomorrow night for this tribute to Tom Petty, but talk with us a little bit as a musician yeah. and with your music, sort of what he had meant to you and sort of his impact. Oh my gosh, he's just, he was just amazing. Like his songwriting and just his performance. I mean, I never got to see him live. I really wish that I had. Um, but, you know, when I would watch uh, videos of him performing, like, I mean, he just was magnificent. And one, actually, one of my favorite things that I learned about him was, um, from, from my boss at my old job in Los Angeles. Um, she used to work at his record label, and she said he was one of the only artists that would come in uh, when something good would happen, you know, he'd release a record. He'd come in and bring every staff member presents like, you know, flowers and candy. He'd come in and do, um, you know, uh, private performances in the office for Aww. them. And I was like, that's class act. Like, that is like, you know, that's who you want to be. That's, you know, that's who you want to support. And um, so I don't know, that, that, that stuck with me. Oh, so have, hearing that story about Tom Petty and all these musicians coming out tomorrow night, talk with us a little about you'll be playing Free Falling? Yeah, um, so so I had put out a video for Free Falling um, about a, I mean, six months ago or so, and Dylan CV, who's putting the show together, thank you Dylan, um, he, he saw, saw the video online and invited me to come, come play. And so I'm really excited because I, I'm going to be um, playing along with the band Americans and Chris Daltrey. Hi, Chris. Who wanted to be here. Yeah. <laughs> um, he, you know, I, I love them and I played with them before, but never sang with them. Um, so um, they're going to be uh, playing with me on that song, and I'm going to sing with them on some of the songs that they're doing. And um, I'm really excited. Like you know, it's it's a sad reason to all have to get together, but. It's at least, you know, it's going to be a really wonderful show. And the proceeds are going to Girls Rock. So I believe the show may be sold out. But <laughs> you can always... still support Girls yeah, Rock. Yeah, you can still support Girls Rock, which is an amazing organization that, like, really helps a lot of girls get into music. And 